Welcome to the outskirts of Berlin. Berlin? Berlin. Berlin? Berlin? Berlin. Berlin. I cannot say. Um, so, what has happened? I, I wanted to actually show you after this turn was over. Because, well, yeah. Um, but I couldn't attack uh, Dresden properly. The army inside Berlin was always reinforcing them, so they actually tried to push me out and I decided, well, I'm not going to fight a two-on-one battle. It's not favorable, favorable to me, even though I had the high ground and whatnot. So what I did was I retreated forcefully and the game decided, yeah, that's exactly where you want to go. You want to go all the way back and have your army basically in shambles. So I had to retreat back. They reinforced Dresden with more troops, unfortunately. And and yeah, that was about it. And then the second army was finally ready to come into combat. So I got him into combat. And this is it. This is the second Württembergian army, or however you say it. It is finally ready for combat. And the first battle that they're going to fight is a defensive battle. And if we win this, hopefully we will, we will take Berlin, which should be very, very nice. The Prussian army is advancing towards us. And I've been thinking, we could make the German Empire it would be good, I I guess. Like taking Silesia, taking all the other provinces that belong to the German Empire at the time. Yeah, that, that could be one of our objectives. I wouldn't mind doing that. Also, I have half a mind to just send my cavalry in take out their artillery. Because they are just attacking that. And one good thing is, this: these are stakes against cavalry, but they work marvelously well against bullets, cavalry charges, charges in general as well. It's just a marvelous thing to have. Oh, don't come over this. I, oh my. Oh my, oh my, oh my. That was great. Right. One gendarme And one less gendarme Yeah, I also didn't think you guys would be able to do it, though. <laughs> All right, then. Okay, and with that charge... Okay, are they doing like in Napoleon, where they just protect the artillery with one cavalry unit? I'm guessing they are doing exactly that. Also, I don't know what they're doing. They're just all around the place, confused over everything. But I didn't want to advance my cavalry because it is the only thing defending this flank. This flank, quite good. They have a lot of infantry for support. Right flank, not so much. Right, and I don't know... Where you guys are aiming at. You're not doing what Napoleon's of the war did, where... The first volley you shot, he just kept on shooting at that place. Guess not. Okay, good. I 
I don't know what the Prussian army is doing, so whenever they actually attack us, I'll start recording again, but all these one units of cavalry just suiciding into us, I am not going to record that. Uh, I feel it is quite, quite a waste of time to record that. Let's just go on to the proper battle. So, see you guys whenever we actually whenever we actually get the battle going. I think they are getting ready to actually attack us, but they're going to set this trap off. Yeah, there was the Deadhead Hussars as well. We're going to... Are we going to kill... Yeah, we're going to kill every single last one of them. And... Yeah, the Prussian army, I believe, is actually ready to attack. I'm going to keep them like so. But I'm going to have my cuirassiers come over here and I'm going to have my line infantry march all the way to there. Alright, the Prussian army is... Yeah, that is a proper attack. Alright, this one is out of position. What do we have over here? Line infantry, line infantry, line infantry, citizenry, 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 line infantry, line infantry, and line infantry. Okay, those guys are not prepared for a charge. Will I need to? I think I will need to bring my infantry... Actually, no, I will not. My cuirassiers will be able to deal with them no problem whatsoever. Alright then, perfect, marvelous. And are they... I think they are charging. Send them back. And off fire will. I didn't realize that we were attacked over on this flank by some gendarme. Yeah, they probably went around there and just attacked us. That is quite alright, I guess. Also, what is taking you so long to actually deal with just that one unit. Okay, and we are... Good. Perfect. We didn't even lose that many men. Alright then. What about here? You're taking just... Way too long... To actually... Beat... One unit of line infantry that doesn't even have... Proper things to deal with you. Other than the bayonet. Right, you, my lads. Shall I get into position? And I wouldn't advise you guys to actually come near us. Okay, you didn't. Right, stop shooting, find new targets. They never know how to do that, so. It's up to us to actually make them realize, oh, oh, oh dearie me, oh, we have to actually shoot at something. We are an artillery regiment that's not shooting at a single damn thing. All right, you're not needed here. We basically lost all of that, but that doesn't really matter. The Empire Total War replenishment system 
It takes two turns, I believe? Mm, yeah. Two turns and... The entire army is ready. And... Yeah, the... Mm, I th I don't know what the Prussian army was doing throughout the entire battle, but they blew it. I mean, instead of they didn't even make a cohesive line. They just oh you can attack that one. Oh you can attack that one. Oh let's go and attack. Try and go through the flank. But they have more infantry, sir. Let's go through the flank. I mean, it's not, they're not viable tactics, I guess, so, so I don't know what they were doing, that's why everyone complains about the AI for her, for this game, it's just rubbish. Right, all three of you, get in there, the three of you get in there. You two can hold the flank. Yes, hold it. And... Okay, never mind. Stay where you are. Because... Yeah, they, they always strike. Yeah, we're going to the flank. Oh, let's flank them. Let's flank them. Not viable tactics if you do not have the infantry or the manpower to pull it off. And I don't know what they're doing anymore. I really, really don't. They're just making the battle take longer than it needs to go on. Right, and this group... Get yourselves up there. This one is the third one, alright. You guys can set yourselves up there. And both of you can go there. And the three of you can go there. Marvelous. There's just... Ah, they just took way, way, way too long to actually do anything. Oh, and they're, now they're trying to do something. Oh my god, what can it be? It's cavalry. What will they do? They're going to protect the artillery. <laughs> oh my... Okay, um, hopefully we don't have to fight that many battles, and we can just... Okay, Artillery, you're doing more damage to my men than you are doing to the enemies. Are they... are you all reloaded? Yes, yes you are. Go one volley is down, two volleys are down, that unit is gone. And there's the cavalry. All, right, all of you can form a square. That way the units behind you can actually shoot. No, but seriously, where the hell are you going? You're just making this battle take longer than it needs to go on. Okay, there we go. What about you? You guys are ready to shoot? Yes, yes you are. What about you? Oh, oh, there we go, finally. And everyone has routed. Perfect, the battle is done, finally. And we can go back to the campaign map knowing that we're going to take Berlin and Dresden, well, probably not Dresden this time around because they have a bigger army that they, than they had initially. We'll see. Here we are on the turn. 
that I actually wanted you guys to show. I already moved my army over to here, but as you can see, even though their army is not that good and we have guards, and they even have one citizen, because they have the mega general, the game decides, yeah, you know what? You, you don't have the majority to win this. So I'm going to keep the siege. But for Berlin, though, that's another story. Also, looking at the borders, I do want to take Stuttgart, Munich, not Prague. I want to take Dresden, Breslau, Berlin, Hanover, Cologne. I think that. I don't know what's that. We're going to take West Prussia and also, excuse me, East Prussia. So those will be our campaign objectives for Europe. Other than that, not nothing else. We want to go for the colonies. Now it is time to actually take Berlin. I don't think I can demand them a surrender, but I really don't care. I want to take them all out. There we go. Berlin is now ours, which is marvelous. And we now, yes, we should be able to get all of these. Magdeburg, I am sorry, we don't need that. I do, however, want to exempt him from taxes. We need to repair that, 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 and really, you made the Royal Observatory. Uh, we're going to have to change that as well. And we're going to make that recruitment... Also, in terms of recruitment, I am going to disband the Jaegers because I'm quite bored with them. And now I'm actually going to have three units of Grenadiers, which I think will be better for us. They're not... The Jaegers haven't done many kills and they're just a bother to actually try and control all. And we don't need a chapter school, thank you very much. Right, other than that, Stettin. So Stettin is that one. Do they not have another port? No, they do not. All right then. So that is it for now. Whenever we're ready, we're going to take Dresden. <laughs> 